is Friday the 16th of April. I'm off to work and I'm taking in this protein bar for breakfast. 214 calories. So for my lunch today, I'm taking in this snack um, pot prosciutto with cheese and little toasted bits of bread. It's 180 calories for the pack. I've got a 79 calorie pack of French fries. I've got this Danone yogurt, which is 78 calories. So no added sugar one. And then I have got this little pack of Jaffa cakes. There's three in there and they're 46 calories each. And that's everything I'm taking in. So I will catch you later. Bye guys. So I finished work. I've got the kids. And now I'm on the way to Tesco on my own. So I need milk and bread. And a couple of bits for the weekend. So I had a good Starbucks delivered today. So I was going to do one of those meals tonight. And then my husband said he wants curry and chips from the chip shop because if you watched my vlog the other day you would have seen me saying that that's what he was having for his tea and the salt grinder opened up and went all in his dinner and ruined it and then he ended up dropping what he did have so that went in the bin so it's Friday night and he said he wants to take away so accommodate a takeaway but I don't want a takeaway. I've got way day in the morning if you didn't know already. So I am having something else. I don't know what. I'm not going to make a gusto meal just for me. So I'm thinking I may do a salad. I've got a scotch egg in the fridge that I haven't had. As I was leaving the house Mackenzie was asking if he could have it and I said no. So whether that is still going to be there when I get home is anyone's business. So I may pick up a little salad and do salad tonight. A fancy salad with potato salad and then something. So I might just get some meat and just do a salad. I've got exactly 800 calories left because on the school run I had three travel sweets. 60 calories and three little sweeps. I counted them anyway. Which now means I've got 800. And when I was in work, my colleague brought in some sugar free biscuits. And they were 29 um, calories each. They were sugar free ones. You're getting home bargains. The good, is it Gullion? They come in a box. Uh, 29 calories so I said thank you very much I'll try one of them so I counted that yeah so dead on 800 I've got left and those biscuits they were sugar free and they were only 29 calories but they're the sort of biscuits you could sit down and drink and probably get through quite a few so I think they're a bit dangerous I don't know if I'd buy them so yeah and I also want to pick up something to make a nice Possibly a nice breakfast tomorrow. Not sure what because tomorrow I get extra calories because it's my easy day or easier day. However, depending on weighing tomorrow is whether I carry on with an easier day or not. I will be weighing before um, I eat my breakfast so I can always reset it. But I'll let you into a little secret. I did have a cheeky way yesterday, and I did have a cheeky way this morning. And those scales are looking good. So I hope it stays that way for the morning. But I will officially weigh in the morning on Saturday as I do. Bearing in mind, I have upped my calories this week I had my easier day so overall I've had more calories but hopefully I still will have a weight loss so if I do get the weight loss that I've had 
Oh, dear. Very again. If I do have the weight loss tomorrow that I think I've got, then bring on the easier day. Can't wait for that. So, yeah. An extra... What do I get? An e about an extra 700... About an extra 700 calories or something, I think it is. From memory. Yeah. Going down past Station Hill again. It's always a queue here at this time of day. Going past Greg's. Oh, God, Greg's sausage roll. Mm. I do love a Greg's sausage roll. That's what I love about calorie counting, the flexibility of eating so-called, what should we call it? Shit. Yes. Shit. I know, I, I'm not a, fruit, a five fruit and veg girl a day. Who needs to be when you lose weight on what I'm eating? You may agree, you may not agree, but oh, all that fruit and veg. And it's mega expensive, all the fruit and veg all the time. So if I can eat the stuff I like, and lose weight that I'm losing, so yeah, it's a winner. I put a thing up on, um, on TikTok and Facebook and Instagram earlier. It's like um, one of the things. Because I've worked out that I only need to lose I think it's eight pound I think I need to lose and I will have lost from my biggest ten stone. Ten stone. It's crazy. It's like I've been carrying around a person on my on my back for all these years. I'm telling you now, if I was ten stone heavier now, I'd either be dead. Well, then I wouldn't be 10 stone, would I? But I'd either be dead or I would be immobile, stuck in the house, miserable. So, only you, only you can change you. I can't tell you to diet and then, yeah, you diet and you'll be right. Unless you do it for yourself, you'll never do it. So you've got to say to yourself, what do you want more? Do you want that bar of chocolate or do you want a weight loss? However, calorie counting, you can have that bar of chocolate and that weight loss. Because those of you who watch daily what I eat, you'll see every day I'm eating some sort of um, chocolate or sweet. It's not a day goes by where I think, oh, I haven't, I haven't had a, any nice things to eat. I eat nice things every single day. But what I don't do is I don't eat all day long like I used to. I don't snack on food all day. I have my breakfast, I have my lunch, I have my dinner. There's occasional, occasional days where I think, oh God, I am a bit hungry and I'll just have something to keep me going. But I don't constantly graze all day like where before. When I was bigger, I'd have my breakfast. As soon as I'd eat my breakfast then, I was eating something else. I wasn't even angry, but I just ate it because I did. Because I loved my food. And I still love my food. I've just learned how to control it. And I've just arrived at Tesco, and it's friggin' mega busy. Let's hope I don't get in any fights today. Tesco. I'm not like that. I'm a nice person. Honestly, I am. Ah. All picking up their click and collects. I don't like click and collects. I like to pick my own stuff. See what I get in Tesco's? Yeah, well, no. 
It's um I'm not planning on getting a lot, she says. I'll show you what I did get because when I get home they'll all be munching on their chippy. So I'll have time to show you. And then I only get my pajamas and I don't want to do absolutely nothing tonight. Emma Day Al Coronation Street. That's the highlight of my life. Saw a few of my neighbours sorting out garden chairs, so I can imagine there's going to be a few um, a few garden parties going on. But yeah, let's go and hit test. Oh, honest to God, I thought I knew someone over there. Then the amount of people going in Tesco now. So I will catch you. For a little shopping haul if I get anything worth showing you. So bye guys. So I'll just show you what I picked up in Tesco's. It's a bit of a madhouse here at the moment. So I'll try and do this quickly. So I got some curly whirlies, 97 calories. 81 calories for birthday cake thins. I got a five pack of chew -its. We all like chew -its in this house. And you are looking at 392, but that's per 100 grams. I'll stick on screen what they are, a tube. I got some 30% reduced fat cheese, and that is 94 for 30 grams. I got some pan of chocolates, and these are 234 per one. Beef hula hoops. 120 calories a bag. I got two of these Belvita bars. I got the cherry and hazelnut. 168. And I also got the dark chocolate and hazelnut. 166. I got two of these coffees. Not for me, they're for my son. Per drink, 161 for the latte cappuccino. And then this one, 207. What one's that? Latte caramel. Mac. Oh, God. What's that? Maki. Atio. Oh, I don't know. Whatever. Two of these mini cheddar sticks. These ones are 116 for 25 grams. And these ones are. 116 for 25 grams so they are exactly the same i got some of these sourdough crackers i thought they would be nice if i was having like a snack plate and these are 110 for 25 gram portion i got some mini cheddars the six bags in there smoky barbecue 132 a bag. I also got some snack and jacks, 89 calories a bag. I got some Vimto for the kids. I'm not a fan of Vimto as in a drink, but you're looking at five calories for 250 ml made up. And I got some dark berry tango sugar free cans, and they are 13 calories a can. That's my next lot. I got some scotch eggs. These ones are 265 per egg. Got those. I also picked up these coronation chicken pies. They're like a pork pie, but obviously coronation chicken. They are new and they are 191 a pie. I got some crunchies, 149 calories, a bar, double deckers, 215 a bar. I got some orange dairy milk. This is 107 for four pieces, which is the length, the width of there. So that's not bad. I got a Reese's butter chocolate bar which is 100 grams 520 
I've had that before. It's absolutely stonking. And I got some zebra Kit Kats. 217. Not sure of how many of them I'll get to have. I got some wraps. And these ones are 173 a wrap. I just picked up some part bake rolls to have to hand. And you're looking at 221 for half a roll. I got some crumpets. I couldn't believe these crumpets. They were only 25 pence. I didn't I thought they were marked up wrong, but they were they were the right price. 99 calories. It's my niece's birthday soon, so card for her. I got some of their own make cereal bars for kids to take to school for break time. 83 calories a bar. Picked up some more of these because I had the last packet today. Me and the kids have been having these in our lunches. 46 calories for one Jaffa cake and they come in little packs of threes. I got another loaf, the cinnamon and raisin toasty loaf. I did buy one and I never got to even get a piece of it. So you never know, I might get a piece of this one. 113 calories for around about 40 grams. Some croissants, these are 161. Milk, semi skimmed, 100 ml, 48 calories. I also got some Tesco Finest sourdough bread and you were looking at 118 a slice and that's the next lot. I'll just show you the next bit, bearing in mind I did what they did say I wasn't getting a lot. This is the last of what I picked up. I got some sweet easy peelers. I'll stick on screen what one of those is. Some bananas, I'll stick on screen what they are. That's them. I got some asparagus. I fancied that because either to have with poached eggs or make boiled eggs and use them as soldiers instead of bread. Blueberries, I'll stick on screen. I've got this beetroot salad, which I'll be having some with my dinner tonight. It's only 24 calories for a quarter of the pack. I've got this naked ham, which is really low, 21 for a slice. got some reduced strawberries that I had planned to eat in the car on the way back, but I forgot about them, actually. I'll stick on screen the strawberries. This is what I am having for my dinner, Greek salad. It's really good, this one, on calories. It's only 139 for the pack. So you've got olives and some feta, a dressing and salad. And then I'm going to put a scotch egg and beetroot salad with that. Now, I got these. I had one of these in my lunch today, you would have seen. And they're still on offer, so I bought the other flavours because they are, honest to God, so nice. You wouldn't think that they were like no added sugar. Now, these are the raspberry ones. And the raspberry ones are 79. I got strawberry ones. They are 80. I got mango, carrot and banana, which I think sounds lovely. They're 78. And then I got the peach which is 78. Now, they did have a ginger one as well, but it was sold individually, and it was four pots for three quid, and I'm not paying that, anyway, when they're only one pound odd. I got some peppers. I'll stick on screen. No, I won't. This is for there. Oh, 29 calories for 100 grams. I just picked up a deodorant. I got some of these kind bars. They were selling them off. Not sure why. There's quite a good date on these ones. They are caramel, almond and sea salt. These are absolutely delicious. They're just packed full of nuts. And you are looking at 211 a bar. I got some Heck Chicken Italia sausages. 
81 for two. I've got some garlic and herb chicken. 96 calories for half the pack. Picked up these hot dog rolls purely because I saw them and they had long dates on them. So I thought they were great just to have in for the kids. And these are 176 for one. And then I got a pack of Rivitas. I thought these would be good for work because they're individually packed. 40 calories per cracker. And I got some more school trousers because I have literally just put them into new school trousers and Dexter is busting out of his already. And that is my lot. Rather rushed because I haven't had my dinner yet. They've all had their chippy. I need to get this all put away and then I'll show you my dinner. So bye guys. This is what I've got for my dinner. I have got the Greek salad I just showed you in my shopping haul. So that's 139 for the salad. And then I have got a scotch egg. It is this scotch egg, which is the Jolly Hog I bought the other day in Sainsbury's. And for the whole scotch egg, it's actually 308 calories. And then I have got 132 grams of the beetroot salad that I also showed you in the shopping haul, and that comes to 62 calories. So 509 calories for my meal. Now this scotch egg says it's got a gooey centre, so let's see if it does or not. A gooey yolk. Oh yeah, it does look. Where is it? I can't see through there. Can't break it open. Mm. Yeah, it has certainly got a gooey yolk. Look at that. Lovely. So that is my tea. And I have got something really exciting to show you what I'm going to have for pudding. It's something that I've had sent to me. And I'm so excited. So I'll show you that when I've had this. So bye. So I'm just getting to the last of my calories. And I'm going to have one of these for 104 calories. These skinny chocolate orange pots. And then I've had this box delivered. Now I knew I was getting a parcel, but I didn't know what it was. And I have been talking for a few months to Joanne Morgan, CC, who also does calorie counting. And we talk morning, noon and night. Get on really well. And I haven't met yet because of obviously COVID, but we, I've become really good friends. Um, I've sent her some things and she sent me some things and she sent me these. Now, I she didn't know that I wanted these because I saw these on TikTok. I think Lawrence had them on TikTok and I was thinking, oh, I fancy some of them, but I've got so many snacks here. I thought I won't buy them yet. I'll wait until I don't have many snacks. But she must be psychic because in this box oh, 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 is pure heavenly so save up to 23% with our membership club save on shipping priority delivery special discount prize draws pause at any time cancel easily change your flavors whenever Um, tasting tips eat at room temperature avoid eating straight after sugary foods remember our bars have 45% less sugar than leading UK brands start with the traditional flavours e.g. mint so they're dairy free gluten free palm oil free which is always good so what does that say Sophie and Lucy the daughters of a founder Stephen are the inspiration behind Pure Heavenly. Being dairy and sugar intolerant, Stephen has always been aware of the impact that food has on on health. His simple wish for his, was for his girls to never have to miss out on the joy of chocolate. He set out to create the per 
perfect alternative chocolate and his girls turned out to be the most willing taste testers. The result was pure heavenly. Today our mission is simple, to make delicious chocolate that is accessible to everyone. We only work with ethical cocoa suppliers and contribute to charities that provide clean water, education and shelter around the world. <clears throat> So, these bars, they are thin, but they're big. They're quite big. So, oh, focus, 43% cocoa. So, there's a hazelnut one. There is a salted caramel one. There is a banana one, which I'm having tonight. <clears throat> Strawberry. Coconut. Silk, orange, and mint. So I am super excited to try these. That's so kind of Joanne. And yeah, so I don't know if any of you have tried these, or if you haven't, if you want to try them because you've seen these. There's no discount code or anything in the box I can give you, unfortunately. Um. <clears throat> The one that I'm having, the banana one, this is 138 calories for the bar. So yeah, super chuffed. So I'm going to enjoy my bar and my orange, chocolate orange snack. And that will be me done for the night. I'm coming in with 49 calories left to spare. And I will catch you tomorrow. So thanks for watching, guys. And tomorrow it is way day. So how will I have done on my change of calories? We shall see. So if you are new to my channel, don't forget to give me a subscribe if you've enjoyed this video and a like. And I'll catch you tomorrow. So bye, guys. Yeah, I'm